Morning. Welcome, All right. Welcome back. Yeah. Nice and sunny again. Yeah, it's not bad today. It's a bit, bit frosty this morning, but it's yeah. sun's out. I'd like to say thank you to all the new subscribers. I really do appreciate it. Thank yeah, you so brilliant. much. Yeah. Yeah. Really nice of you. Yeah. And all the comments. Yeah. Thanks, Vince, for uh, the information on the uh, the uh, tempest and the food. I've ordered the food. That's on its way. Get rid of that other stuff. It's rubbish. So, there you go. I'm sure you all know, Vince. But if you don't, go along to Twisted yeah, Koi. Yeah. Pop over Twisted Koi. It's amazing. Yeah. Great bloke. Very, very clever man. Great bloke. And we got another Mind of information. And another person to say morning to G Love. Oh, G. Colossal Koi. Go over and have a look at this. Yeah, he's good. It's mind blowing. He's got love. <laughs> well, we've said it before. Amazing, amazing product. Yeah. yeah and it's, and yeah. it's nice, G, to have you on our Facebook page. Yeah, he's lovely bloke. Yeah, really nice. Right, Gary and Caroline and. Joss and Mark and Ollie and Steve and Kat. Steve, Kat. We want to say hello to all of you, yeah, and, hello, and especially you? the ones that haven't got channels. Yeah. You know, yeah. you know, thanks, thanks Dale, Tom, everyone. So yeah, we do appreciate it. So what are you going to do with that? Well, what do you reckon I should do with it? <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, I'm going to. Um, I've got to do some more brackets you know blocks to go on the wall yeah put the brackets on for the pipes because obviously the limited space there we're having to bring pipes away from the wall to go around other pipes and that so it's just blocking to bring them out and i know we keep saying it we've been talking in the kitchen this morning about um tiles we've really got to get on with it haven't we really yeah yeah it's not gonna happen otherwise uh, we've got to get them sorted and then the guy that's doing fiberglass we need to phone him back won't we email him yeah, you've got to get that corner. Yeah. It's an awkward situation because you get it dry and then you contact him and it rains and gets wet again. It's yeah, it's not instant, is it? It's got to be arranged and come across to the other white. It's all right covering it all up, but it still seems to get in. And that, that's like Jill said, that's, that's the other thing. Being on the island, he's got to make arrangements to come across. Yeah. And that's not cheap either, not on a ferry with a, with a van. We no. want a spell, don't we? I know we can't. Ex we know yeah. we're asking for too much. I know it's January, but you need yeah, a spell of like a, over two weeks. It's still early days, isn't it? It's still yeah. late January. I mean, we come, John. Look what you've done in a short time. You started it in November. Yeah. Um, you know we can't be too. You know, but oh, no. No. we just want to get on. Then we've got to order the glass. Well, once we get that, it's like the concrete situation again, isn't it? Once we get <laughs> the fiberglass in. Them real way. Yeah. Same um, as the concrete. I mean, if we can get those fish in March, because oh. you got to, you got the syndrome, the water, haven't you? The well, yeah. Someone, bacteria. Someone said about it last night in one of the comments. I, I, what I was going to do was use like fifty percent of this water mm. into the pond. I know it's not a great amount, but it's sunny. It's to start the bacteria off, isn't it? And then the obviously top that one up, and the butterfly going there. But I'm sure we'll get them in. Yeah, March, yeah. then we've got the whole yeah. summer, haven't we? Yeah, well, we know this pond syndrome thing we're going to have to deal with anyway. Yeah. So. But you can't build up the bacteria without the fish, can you? So it's catch 22, isn't it? Just keep an eye on it, don't you? Well, yeah, you just have to be strict with it and keep your eye on it all the time, which we will do anyway. Yeah. We'll do with this one. Yeah. And then you've got the um, fry pond over there. Yeah, I'll finish doing that. I mean, that that's just a little side hobby sort of thing of course yeah but, but there's no great panic for that it's, that's just something i can do as and when yeah but the main thing is get that done yeah and then we have to order some more not a lot just a few bits of pipe mm. uh, just to get it all connected up yeah so i'm going to try and do that bit of staining yeah you might get away with that today i know it looks all right yeah so we'll so we'll get on get on and do that We'll uh, speak to you later. Jill's got her stain out. She's got her stain out. Got my stain out. <laughs> really, I am tempted in my roots at the moment, John. They're getting quite bad. Is that why you're wearing the hat? That's why I'm wearing the hat, guys. <laughs> Anyway, let's get on with it instead of keep talking. You know, you lot know how I love staining. That 
absolutely love staining stuff. Right. Here goes. I'm only using a small brush because I don't want to get it on the uh, felt. A bit of um, card or something to mask off. Yeah. You know, just to hold there while you paint it and move it along. That is a good idea. It's a good job I bought cans and cans of this uh, black stain, isn't it? I knew it would come in useful. had his own wayside window company. Wayside window cleaners. Yeah. <laughs> I like to see a man busy. <laughs> did I do anything else? <laughs> I know. I look really clean, don't I? Yeah. You need a cough to wipe yeah. them over. But we get some air in here today. Yeah. Because uh, it's a bit stuffy in there. John's in his playpen. Don't, don't be a rendering. He's chucked his toys out of it, you know. That's all right. It's looking good. Let's take you off the stand because there's no point in just leaving you up here on the decking. So, yeah, look at the rendering. That's really neat, John. Just got to do this bit and that bit. That looks really good. Well, I did find, oh, in the bottom, of course. Yeah. Well, I did find some pond paint that we painted that pond with. Oh, yeah, the black stuff. So, rather than buy fiberglass, and I can always paint it. You can. If I've got enough paint. Because that paint seals the pond doesn't it John? Yeah it's rubberized isn't it? Yeah it's, it's designed specially for that. And I've got some left from after doing that one. Yeah. So I'll have a look see how much. See if yeah because that's what all that black stuff is. When we uncovered this pond it, it was cracked and different things so John's cladded it you know put concrete around it and then he painted it with this rubber paint. So that's perfect for, uh, for this little uh, pond over here. Oh. That's just the uh, water change done. Yep. Yeah. Just topping back up. All the waters have been checked too. Oh, and we obviously we don't just put water in, we do use the conditioner as well. And, and also behind scenes, we're always checking the waters. Tap water conditioner. Yeah, check the pond water and that, but we, we thought we're not going to keep showing it on film. Well, you've done it a few times, haven't you? Yeah. No. Without doing the checks, you know, the fish wouldn't survive, would they, John? you got to do it. Sorry? you got to do the water checks. Oh, well, yeah. You know, you can't get away of not doing them. No. Well, it looks, looks like it's going to be a nice day again. Um, pond's nice and dried out. 
John's just finished off around the edges and also he's just done the corner just there curved it and that um, so yeah looking good nice dry day um, I've finished staining on top on the roof and um, really today I'm just going to go around the garden and see what what I can do tidy it all up I know it's stained the back of this fence but I think I'll put another coat on it I mean you can get to it when, once the summer house is here we've made it you know got the right size so you can get around the back of it so if you have to repair or do anything but I thought I might as well as it's a nice day and sunny in this corner just put another stain on here it just protects the wood more really can't cut the lawn though that's too wet um, probably see if I can tidy a bit more over there I think with over there we might probably get a small skip just to get rid of all that lot but um, the koi up on the main pond they're okay quite happy um, we check them every day just to make sure that everything's all right we haven't fed them at all uh, since giving the wheat germ towards the end of the summer slowly like you do we haven't even given them a tidbit nothing um, so they seem happy as they are and we don't want to start the recycle so the waters are all clean because we're not feeding them uh, so best to let them stay as they are gives them a break as well really so I'll uh, get back to you later right so what I'm gonna do um, as you know I know it's the summer house section not the pond but it's all part of the garden I'm going to stain the joists because it's like double protection so if I start staining them and painting them it's just added protection I know it will be protected because it'll be under under the decking in summer house but I thought I might as well do it as you know I love staining <laughs> down this side just finishing off this corner and then I'll go back down the other side and it's going to be have a lot of protection I know it's going to be sheltered with the uh, summer house in front of it but it's nice to protect the wood I mean, it costs enough to buy so you know it's good you know you look after it like, like everything in life isn't it if you look after it then you know, you're protecting it, aren't you? So, good job I bought all those uh, cans of paint. It's like B&Q in our uh, workshop, as John says. B&Q run out, they can always come to us. Yeah, she's doing a good job here, isn't she? Oh, hello. <laughs> well, I'll just point you your teeth. <laughs> I know, but I didn't know you'd come back. Yeah. <laughs> I thought you'd gone off back to the garden. Oh, you're flying around now, aren't you? Yeah, I know. It, no to one of you on there. It looks the same. Oh, it's the same. But um, yeah. we've done layers and layers. The trouble is, once once we get to summer house, it's going to be restricted to get around. Yeah. You'd be able to get down there. Yeah. But you might as well do it now before we get it. So it's a sensible thing to do, isn't it? Yeah, and uh, over time you layer it, don't you, off, staining. Yeah. So it does 
protect it. Well, that's good, isn't it? Mm. So. I love it when I'm staying. I don't even talk. Less to do later. I'm quiet, aren't I? Yeah. I was saying to them, good job we got loads, because if yeah. B&Q goes short... We can supply. Yeah, at yeah. cost. So I'm just rendering the pond, that little pond over there. That's doing all right. Do you want to take them over and show them? Yeah, I'll show them in a minute. I'll, <laughs> as I'll, as I'll, you try and get off here? I'll get the first the walls done for us. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. We'll catch you later on. Yeah. Morning. Right. And morning, little Noah. Happy first birthday, sweetheart. That's my grandson, bless happy him. Happy birthday, Noah. Yeah, happy birthday to you. <laughs> yeah. Bless him. And... Oh. Who's that strange woman on, on telly? It's my nanny. Honestly, watch us, <laughs> me. And John's busy, as you can see. Yeah. Um, finished inside. Let's just take you off. It's starting to rain now. Oh, never stops. No, I know. They got it wrong. Sack them. Um, I'm just putting some cladding on the front of this. I've done all the inside. That's all the all. inside's done. All done. And we got some uh, spare cladding that was given to us ages back. And thought, hmm, it's the same colour as um, as up there, the wood. So we thought, oh, let's put it on the side. Well, yeah. So it's just got plastic covers on it at the moment. But um, I thought that'd look nice. It will blend in nicely. So um, John's doing that. So I'll let him get on with it, and we'll uh, finish our coffee. All right. Just putting this cladding out. It goes on the outside of houses. You know, in the apex. We had some in the garage. So I thought I'd just stick it on the front. John. Yeah. Oh yeah. Look, it's just arrived from the post. Oh right. That's that. What you recommended, uh, Vince. So I ordered some, and that was quick. You only ordered it yesterday. No, the day before. Oh, was it? I lose track of time. Oh, that's good. They so yeah, some... Vince, they'd uh, be fed on that now. Decent food then. Oh, cheers, Vince, for that yeah. recommendation. Uh, yeah. I'll just go and put it in the. Yeah. Uh, All right. Yeah. yeah. Well, we're just having a jump out here every time it stops raining. Seems to be a bit blue now. Uh, it's good. But we're oh, it's getting muddy round here, John. Yeah, we're down walking on it. Have to put some grass seed down. Yeah. But um, it's going to look alright, isn't it? It's going to go with yeah. the colour of the wood up here. Because yeah. originally we were just going to paint it, weren't we? Well, yeah. But it was a spare bit of cladding. Yeah, so it was in the garage, so... And it, it, looked, it looked attractive there. Might as well use it, it matches the shed. Yeah, what are you going to do though? Because have you got, you haven't got enough to go around, have you? I've got the side, yeah. Oh, you have got enough to the side now? Yeah. Oh, I didn't think you had. Yeah. So yeah, it's going to look alright, John. I'll just... Uh... Also, we were thinking, right, because it's going to get damp down there. I mean, you can see on the fence with the green, uh, we can always wipe it down. Yeah. Because you've got the decking right next door to it. So you're going to get a bit of, aren't you? But it's easy to wipe. Oh yeah. I've just got to mark it all off and cut it. But, but you just like doing things, don't you, Joe? You get bored if you're not doing something. So have a, let John get on and we'll get back later.
We're back in the filter house. Everything John's uh, cemented in now. So there's no hole there. <laughs> no, that's all done. I've done the waste pipe. What I've done is I've put the T on there and you've got the easy pod and the tempest going through that waste. Mm. And if you come round the back, I made a, a fitting to go on the, the waste outlet. So that's where the waste comes out at the far end by the uh, valve and then just onto here and that'll go into this T and I've just made a fitting. Yeah that purple bit of plastic there that John's bit. done, he's shaped it and it fits in nice, fits on nicely doesn't it John? Yeah and that'll take it all, the easy pod and the tempest to wait, the waste to come out and go into the main pipe which will go into the drain. Yeah, so that's good. So all the waste, the bottom drain as well is all in the one pipe. Mm rather than several different pipes all going out. They all link up to one. Yeah. That's how we've done it. Wow, everyone does it their own way. Whatever suits their pond, they do. Well, it's neat, isn't it? Yeah. I can't stand, well, I know that's scruffy over there, but you know, it will get sorted. But I can't stand unorganized stuff. I like it organized. Good job, we're the same, John. Well, the amount of space we've got in there, Yeah. we have to do things a certain way. Yeah. You know, if, if I had a great big filter shed, then it'd be different. I'd be uh, spacing things out and all sorts. But We're yeah, just lucky we can fit in there. We haven't got that. Yeah. We haven't got that. So we, we have to do what we can do. And if it means juggling points about, then that's the way we have to go. Yeah. But it looks right. It I'm looks really good, John. I think it looks fantastic. Well, I'm happy with it. Right. Yeah, no, it is good. Don't let anyone else tell you any other way. You know, it looks good <laughs> in your face. <laughs> no, it looks really smart. You work hard. Oh, it looks right, right. Yeah. Anyway. Yeah, it's fitting on nicely. Yeah, what I'll do is I'll put a corner on there. Like a bead kind of. I haven't got any proper angle, but I've got a piece of square drain pipe. That's a good idea. So if I cut it, yeah. I'll make a yeah, an shape it round. And that can go on there. Yeah. That tidied out up there. Yeah, looks good. Looks very clean and tidy and smart. What rubbish weather today. It's supposed really? to be sunny. Look at it. it. Restricts you to what you can do. Good old work, workbench there. You fancy um, a cup of tea? Yeah. Okay. John's just finished cladding the sides. He's put the plastic down the edge just to strip it, tidy it up. It looks ever so neat, John. Looks right, doesn't it? Yeah. That looks really nice. Yeah, I'm quite happy with it. It goes in with the uh, fry house and everything. That's very neat. Well, once we get the blocks on the top as well. Yeah. Yeah, to edge it all round. No, that's really neat and tidy. We don't have to worry about the other end because it's no. around the corner. Yeah, that's really good. You've done a good job there. Just made up of bits we've had left, hasn't it? I like the way um, you look at the fry, fry house. You look down, it all blends in. It's over bricks we had left, though. Rock blocks we had left over yeah that stuff we had left over cement that was left over and that is for uh, to put on our buildings like you say we've got apex in yeah, front the of the apex. bungalow yeah. so it's all waterproof strong and it insulates it a bit john mm. your favorite word yeah isn't it? <laughs> yeah looking good yeah well, that's good right now that's uh Fry, fry tanks all done. I think we're going to call it a day, aren't we? We can't really do a lot more, can we? Well, it's getting late now and the weather is great. It's supposed to be nice tomorrow. We'll crack on and do some more tomorrow. Yeah, and we'll think about contacting the five glass guy. Right, we want to do these tiles too, don't we? Yeah, Not we've got to get on with all that. So these are the bits in between, aren't they? Yeah, it's the niggly bits, isn't it? We've got to get 
a little bit of pipe work as well. Yeah. And getting pipes underground, down yeah. the side. Um, and that's it really, isn't it? Yeah. Just the fiberglass in. And um, then, hopefully, a nice spring. Yeah. Then summer. Yeah. You better get a nice summer too. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So really, it's just um, limbo a bit at the moment, isn't it? Yeah. You know what you need to do in that. Well, I'm sure we'll find something to do tomorrow. Yeah, we've always got something to do. Anyway, yeah. those of you that haven't subscribed yet. Yeah, if you could, that'd be fabulous. I mean, it's coming on now, yeah. isn't it? Yeah, we're really getting there now. Not many more now, really, to a thousand. Getting close. It is really. Yeah. So thank you for those of you that follow us and have subscribed. Yeah. But um, yeah, anyone that hasn't yet, please do so. Yeah, of course, send the boys round. <laughs> send the coy round. Yeah. Um, so um, we'll see you in our next episode, and yeah. that'll be Sunday. Yeah. So see you later. See ya.